Vandal. And today is a 2016 song with 1.6 billion views. They expect me to get it by the synth. Okay. Well, let's hear the drums. I do, I'm gonna, uh, I just really, I was gonna, about to say, and I will still say, I do feel like I recognize it, but I also realize that I say that literally every single time. Because I'm like, oh, I think I recognize this song. I mean, I do, I do think I recognize this, but honestly, the only song I can think of right now is a song I know for certain this is not, which is Silver Scrapes, and I know this is not Silver Scrapes. Maybe with the, the synth, I guess not one plus two, but just synth. Ah, I do know this song. I don't know what it's called. Maybe the voice cover will like, let me know. Probably gonna need to do the clue this time. I do, I do know this song. Ah, yep. Mike Posner. Again, I knew I recognized the song. I just could not remember what it was called for the life of me. Anyway, Okay, Doku. Uh, this is an official Okadoku puzzle. Oh, grass fighting, just hit me with the Breloom. That's easy. Fighting baby, I'm fairly certain, is literally only Riolu. Fairy baby is like Kleppa. Johto. Johto is Gen 2? So this is like Togepi? Uh, Johto Dark Types would be, I'm fairly certain it is Houndour. Well, Johto Grass Type is easy. Chikorita. And a Fighting Dark Type is... Angoro. Very dark is Grimmsnarl. I don't I don't know why I can't think of a Johto dark type. In a fairy grass, I'm just lost. I feel like fairy grass would be something like Brute Bonnet, but I don't think Brute Bonnet is uh I mean, that's what my guess will be if I can think of a Johto Dark type. Like, in my head, it's Houndor. But also in my head, that's wrong. And same thing, Murkrow, because I think Murkrow is Gen 2, but Hongchrow is Gen 4. I just walk myself through the routes of Johto and see like what Pokemon I remember. I'm just gonna hit him with the Hound Door. Yeah, okay, that was right. And then Grass Fairy. I think Rubon is actually poison type, to be completely honest. But
Uh, but I have no clue. What? Like, I know that Hatterene is a fairy, but I think it's very psychic. Your fairy ghost. Cowboy hat Caterpie is cool as hell. It has nothing to do with it being psychic, though. Eh. I think Brute Bond is actually poison, but... Yeah. Whimsicott, Tapu Bulu. Ah, Shinotic I should have gotten. Shinotic and Marlow. I did not remember that Whimsicott and Cottony got a fairy typing. I just remembered them being grass. And Tapu Bulu, I'm not going to lie. I think Tapu Coco and Tapu Lele are the only Tapus I remember. Oh, I guess Tyrogue is the other baby fighting type. I always forget that Tyrogue is baby. That sentence kind of hurt to say. Anyway, global. Not Egypt. Closer to Egypt than India, though. Spain. Ooh, somewhat close to Canada. How about like a Brazil? Okay, so it's like South America. Oh, no, it's something like a Papua New Guinea. Oh, I'm thinking of Guyana. Always confuse the two for some reason. I doubt it's just Mexico, yeah. Maybe like a Panama? How about a Cuba? Havana? Yeah, sure, I meant Ghana. I, I, oh, hey. Ghana. I think Havana actually is not a country. I believe it is. It is not a country, that's, that's all there is to it. Um, Peru? Dominican Republic? And it's something like right here. This is one that I actually used to know because I did a, uh, like a school project in like middle school, don't get me wrong. I did, like, a school project on Argentina. And just learned about, like, the entirety of South America while I was at it. I don't remember anymore. This is Guyana. Is French Guyana something different? French Guiana, okay. And it is a territory of France, not a country. And it's right here, anyway. I thought it was right here, I'm not gonna lie. Once again, it's a global where I fail, because I don't know geography. But hey, I learned that Ghana is right here. Martinique? Also part of France? Interesting. It's probably one of these things, like right here. Or one of these islands. Uh, okay, nope. Would have been really embarrassing if that wasn't Haiti. I was fairly certain that that's where that was. What is PNG? Oh, Papua New Guinea, obviously. What else could it be? I have officially exhausted the South American countries I know. And that's probably not true. If you, like, gave me a list of countries and asked me which ones were in South America, I'd probably have more. I mean, obviously, I, I know. I'll type it in, but... It's not Argentina. If you gave me a list, I'd probably be able to be like, Oh yeah, this one is in South America. This one is as well. I don't know though. Guess the game. Maybe with an immediate skip. This is 
I was going to say this is uh, like a Metal Gear Solid. Listen, it looks grungy with the star, and I was like, Metal Gear Solid. I was excited for anything in Splinter Cell. And I was like, Metal Gear Solid's wild enough with the like flaming whale from Metal Gear Solid 5. That might be something worth looking into. Um, Just a dude absolutely spinning. Is it like Pikmin? Or? It's a platformer. Oh, that's Kirby. That's Kirby. This is Kirby and the Forgotten Land, I think, is the Switch one. Yeah. Yeah. I have not played Kirby and the Forgotten Lands. I've played Kirby Squeak Squad 100% of that game like six times when I had a DS with Squeak Squad and nothing else. Not literally nothing else, but like no other games. Game Dill. Classic. This is just Celeste. Okay, like, to be fair, look, it looks like Celeste. Is this that game to the moon? Ah, I see. That is not hair. That is a red, like, outfit. It is like a puzzle RPG... Is this Night in the Woods? I don't think so. Oh, and that's not the moon, that's a light bulb. I don't know puzzle games. Yeah, I've got no clue. I, I just lose this one. Oh, it's one shot. You know what? I should have known this because literally right now, I believe. Uh, I need to check this out. Yeah, if I go to my subscriptions, the third video on my subscriptions right now is one shot. This game was released in 2016. Must be having like a resurgence now. So I have heard it brought up like two or three times. Anyway, keywords. UFO Mayor sequel? Oh, this is just Saints Row 4. Ah, damn, imagine. Economy Advisors Building? This is... I guess you're the president in that game, not the mayor. Economy Advisors Building. Is this like Tropico? Tropico 3? Taxation, Budget, Radiation, City Skylines 2, is a sequel, no. Nope. Management, Construction, Never Ending, I mean it's a strategy simulator, Sim, Sim City, new, it is Sim City, okay, Sim City 4, okay, Sim City 2000, okay, it was Sim City 3000, I got that one. They're not going to count it as a streak, but... Uh, anyway, artwork. This is... Average guess one makes me think it's something obvious. What is a game that has a mountain with, like, a sun rising behind it? Is this Celeste? I don't think so. Oh, it's a big torch on top of a mountain? Oh, it's Darkest Dungeon. How does that have average guess one, dude? I guess people who play Darkest Dungeon, but... And also, probably the average guesses are going to be a lot lower than you'd normally expect, because a lot of people probably just cheat. Anyway. 
Gameville Guess. Uh, hit me with the Enter the Gungeon to get Devolver Digital out of the way. And Final Fantasy Final Fam Final Fantasy to get Square Enix out of the way. It is not an RPG, it's not an adventure, so it's probably a shooter of some sort. I know this is an RPG, but no, because Warframe is just third person, according to these guys. Even though I would be willing to argue it has a decent amount of first person, that's probably just because I almost exclusively used the Rubico for like six years. Also, six years is a bit of an exaggeration, but like two or three years, I used exclusively the Rubico, so that's probably why the game's stuck in my head as a first person game as well. Uh, hit me with Spec Ops. Okay, 2012. Unre oh, it's not a shooter. Okay. It's not a shooter, adventure, or an RPG, in which case, I know. Just about no games that fit into that. Um, 2012 Unreal. I mean, Unreal doesn't really help. Oh, take two published spec ops? Wild, because that game fucking sucked. Sorry. The game was just far too heavy handed in its the way it like spoke. Also, that game doesn't have first person either. I kinda knew that though. I mean, hit me with the Minecraft, even though I know it's not the case. Okay, so it is action. Not fantasy. If some sort of like action indie action game. I think a hat in time was not made in Unreal, but oh it was, but it was also released in 2017. It's also fantasy. It's probably third person, first person. Um I know it's not going to be Marvel Spider-Man. I just wanted a Sony publisher. Give me with the one-time flu. Oh, it's just multiplayer and co-op? There's no single player. But it's not like a BR. Because it would probably be a shooter. It's not... Okay, so it's a, it's a hack and slash beat em up probably indie. Because it's not adventure. No, no adventure. An indie hack and slash beat em up released in 2012. Third person, first person. It's only got co. I, I have no idea. Hammer Watch? They don't have Hammer Watch. Total War Warhammer? Uh, Plague Tale Requiem? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, chivalry. Could I have gotten chivalry? Maybe. Looking at all these guesses, never mind. No, I have no clue. Torn banners. St uh, Activision. That would have just gotten me lost if I had gotten Activision to publish. Fighting hack and slash beat him up. I did think it was Dynasty Warriors for a bit. But obviously I believe Dynasty Warriors is just single player. So that wouldn't have uh, been correct. Anyway. Metazua. Start with Frog. Hedgehog. Bat. Uh... Monkey? Rabbit? Rat? Mouse? It's not going to be Capybara again, it was Capybara yesterday, but... Okay, it's not Rat Mouse. Uh, are beaver, aren't beavers technically rodents? 
Okay, yeah, but that's not the answer. And with a single hint, what the fuck are these things? Should have thought of squirrels. Chipmunk. Oh, uh, what are these things called? Groundhog? Yeah, Groundhog. So this time, they didn't just give me the answer. They came pretty damn close, not gonna lie, with uh, this one. Or th this one? I don't remember. The one I clicked hint on came pretty close to just giving me the answer, but it wasn't exactly. Now, Metaflora. Daisy. Poppy. Flax. I know that a rose is basically nothing. Okay, but it's a rose, but not a fabid. It's a rosid, but not a fabid. I don't know what any of this means. Maybe with a rosemary? No, that's... that's you heard any plants. Malvid? Oh, it's just a different type. Okay, well, I hate to do two hints in a row, but obviously I clearly don't. Oh, uh, this is... um. Uh, it's like what? It's like uh, Brussels sprouts? No, they don't have Brussels sprouts as an option. They don't have broccoli as an option. Um, it's it's Brassica olera or something like that. The one that has like eight different plants as part of it. Is spinach one of them? I don't think so. Not cauliflower. It's a... Uh, Oh, I don't want to... Uh, I'll probably look it up after this, but I guess I guess it came with another hint. Oh, yeah, who would have guessed? Ah. Cabbage? They say cabbage. Okay, it is similar. Does lettuce count? No, lettuce is on the other side of the... I mean, in my head, cabbage and lettuce are just so similar. Ah... Uh, Mustard? Fruit crucifer? I'm just looking at words. Heart of mine. Heart of mum. Okay, I thought maybe they were just giving me the answer. Sorry, this is called cardamine, and cardamom is something completely different. Uh, I've got no clue. Watercress. I know what watercress is. That does not mean I could have gotten that. Connections. Oh, you know what? I am going to look this up, though. Okay, it is cabbage. The, the brassica... Oleric... Brassica... Olaracia? What are they? How, okay. How do I pronounce that? Oh, they don't tell me. But it's cabbage, Brussels sprouts, cauliflower, kale, broccoli. Kohlrabi, it looks like. It, basically, it's a lot of stuff. It's all the same plant. It's just... Bread differently. Yeah, broccoli, cabbage, cauliflower, kohlrabi, turnips apparently sometimes. It's all the same plant. Anyway. Banana, hammer, register, sickle, flower, sun, feather, moon, pound, herald, star, bang, croissant, slam, mushroom, chronicle. Okay. Uh... I mean, sun, star, moon obviously pop out, but what would go with them as, like, things in space? Sun, star, moon, there's no, like, planet, there's no asteroid, there's no... None of that. Hammer, pound, slam, bang? They're all, like, hit. 
Yep, hit hard. Can't wait for the new Pokemon moves in Gen 10. Bang and Hammer. Alright, bad joke, but... I just got something in my eye somehow. Oh, and judging by the fact that I don't know what it was or how it got there, it was probably just an eyelash. But still. Ooh. Okay, Flower Sun, Feather Moon, Sickle, Herald, Star, Register. Croissant, Banana, Mushroom, Chronicle. I mean... Oh, wait, never mind. I just went banana. I just did the foods, but I think I don't think there's a fourth food here, really. Um, okay, so banana and mushroom are both words from viral internet songs. What else? Uh, Chronicle, Herald, Star. Register? Yeah, it's not register. Chronicle, Herald, Star. Flower? Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> Chronicle, probably Chronicle Herald Register. Something else. And it's not flower. Feather, maybe? No, okay. Well, I know it's Chronicle Herald... Register. Well, I can't waste too much time on this, eh? Yeah, no, okay. Chronicle, Herald, Register, Sun. Oh, they're newspapers. Crescent-shaped things, banana, croissant, moon, sickle. Power-ups in Super Mario World. Feather, flower, mushroom, star. Yeah, fine. Okay, I don't, I don't like it, but fine. Wordle. Classic Wordle. The crane and tough, as I usually start with. And then... Swims. Holy. Uh. Okay. Um. What what word is this? That's obviously the point. Um, it does have two E's. Oh, I should have known it couldn't have been bleep. Cool. Um, so, but like L E. E E oh, that's leper, but leper obviously it can't be. Lepi? Not a word, okay. Um E P L E
Yeah, I got no clue. I, I, my brain's fried today. I don't know why. Yeah. Uh, I think what's actually happening is I'm really looking forward to playing Minecraft, which is fucking surprising, but also great. Um, I know it's not Leper, but... Expel. Aha. Well. Expel. Means I can still do... Tough train, and I'm still plus two. Um, what is this? Probably like R O T no, R O. Something T H. I don't know if I had to guess for that top right one. Angel? Okay. Uh, that was a pretty bad guess, to be completely honest, but... I'm still plus one. Um... No, it can't be Intel here. Because it needs to have a U. Un... Unted. Untes. Unmet? Oh, okay. Oh, it's probably unset, actually. I can guess unset right now. If it's wrong, I lose. It's not. Okay. Unset. But that does mean I need to get all three of these in one guess. Man, I'm just going like... I'm not even like thinking, I'm just... Just messing it up. What is this? Oh, weekly challenge. Okay. Apparently you need to solve a daily puzzle. Uh, fourth, there we go. Got at least a second word there. I think that's where it ends for me, though, because... Um, something like that. It would be like banal. It is, holy. And then this is B-O something something E. thinking Boise there for a second, but there's no S. And it's obviously that these aren't actually X's. They just use X as placeholders. There's, there's no X in any of these words, especially not this one. E O. Ah. Booze. Oh. Damn, anyway. Banal fourth booze unset. Uh, 
Okay, now I have my beginning guesses out of the way. 32 wordles at once. I know it's a, it's, it's a bad strategy, but it's fun to kind of, like, connect them all. Uh, this is... F-A subset E-R. This is, like, irate, perhaps? Nice. Very glad that that went well. This is front. This is probably trade. This is chant, probably. It's not trade. That one's on me. That is chant, though. This is... Oops. Beast. This is... Chun... This is throw. This is clade. This is trace, and I knew it was trace the whole time. This is Vader. I guess. I guess it's Fader. This is Weave. This one. I've noticed that this game just. Never mind. This is Blitz. River? Anyway, what I was trying to say was that I've noticed that this game eventually just turns into me going, this is this, this is this, this is visit, for example. And this is probably a veil. Yep. This is a part. This is probably spunk, but I don't want to type in spunk. So I will later. This is uh, ascot. I don't know what that means. Don't even know if I pronounced it right. This is aphid. This is probably mecca. This is probably bribe. This is probably evoke. Yes, it is, because it has two E's. Evoke. This is party. This is this is bribe. What else could it be? This is chunk. This is caw. This okay. It, it's spunk. This is baggy. This is leggy, I guess. This is what, D-bus? 
Yeah, I guess so. Didn't really think that was a word, to be completely honest, but... Oh, this is Mixer. Are they still around? Oh, this is Mecca. I thought so, but... Oh, this is probably just Wally. This is Sully. This is... Oh, it's Sumac. I don't know what a lot of these words mean. This is... Skiff. Here we go. Easy win. Not an issue in the slightest. Words were... Trace, fader, leggy, bribe, front, chunk, evoke, throw. Played, irate, sumac, weave, chant, party, ascot, aphid, mecca, cough, wally, baggy, deep, oh, I was about to say debus, uh, debus, wretch, apart, blitz, river, spunk, beast, skiff, visit, avail, mixer, and sully. Wonderful.